as the Apple Macintosh version of the Synology Active Backup for Business Agent, will use hooks in order to install itself into macOS. To uninstall it, we should be using a slightly different technique to that of dragging and dropping the application into the bin of our dock. First, we need to locate where the Active Backup application has been installed. So if from the menu bar of Finder, we select Go, and then after choosing Go to Folder, we type forward slash applications. When we press enter on our keyboard, we will find listed the Synology Active Backup Agent. Alternatively, we can simply open Finder, and then from the sidebar choose Applications. Now from within the Applications folder, if we locate and highlight the Synology Active Backup for Business Agent, by pressing and holding down the Control key on our keyboard, and then right-clicking our mouse, we're presented with a secondary menu that includes the option to show package contents. If we select this option, a new Finder window will open that contains a single folder called Contents. By opening the Contents folder, we will find a script to uninstall the Active Backup for Business application. When we run the script, we're first prompted to confirm that we wish to uninstall the Active Backup agent. If we select Run, Depending on how your instance of macOS has been configured, you might be prompted to enter your administrator's credentials. With authorization to uninstall the application, your Finder window will update to display an icon for your computer's hard drive and the network it's connected to. To confirm that the active backup agent has been uninstalled, if we return to Applications, we should find that Active Backup is no longer listed in the Applications folder.